The consumption of free sugars and processed carbohydrates has increased around the globe in developed and developing countries alike. Lower income groups are particularly vulnerable to high dietary intake, and this has created a disparity in Carrie's experience across socio-economic groups. This inequality has created a global challenge for oral health professionals and so far, few initiatives have successfully managed to address it effectively. In many parts of the world, young children don't go to the dentist. This can be extremely problematic because when caries go untreated, our research shows that affected children can suffer from pain and decreased quality of life. Treatment costs can be high, which puts pressure on families, and this is especially prevalent in those belonging to low-income groups. Silver diamine fluoride, or SDF, is a promising new approach to improving child dental care that we argue should be implemented globally. SDF is a clear liquid that combines the antibacterial effects of silver and the remineralizing effects of fluoride. Numerous studies support the efficacy of SDF for caries in children's teeth and in the prevention of new root caries lesions. SDF should be used in all dental practices to prevent child dental pain and the need for general anaesthetic. Dr. Richard Naderman found that using SDF in community programs can reduce inequality in oral health among children. The same study also showed that SDF delivers a better cost-benefit ratio than traditional oral health care. Dr. Prathit Phantom Vanit showed that a technique called Silver ART, which is the use of SDF in atraumatic restorative treatment, could improve treatment outcomes when compared to ART restoration, again supporting the use of SDF in dental practice. Professor Chung Hung Chu investigated the impact of SDF use in young children and found it could significantly reduce the incidence of new cavities in kindergarten children. The study was so successful that SDF has now been implemented in community treatment programs across Hong Kong. Other countries must follow suit. And Melbourne-based Dr. Jeff Knight demonstrated that SDF usage results in a significant reduction in invasive dental treatments and general anaesthetic, as well as in pain and sepsis. SDF is safe, effective and efficient and is transforming the community approach of dental care for children. SDF could also increase community support and engagement by helping to reduce dental issues for children whose parents have not traditionally seen dental practitioners. This is why we advocate for the inclusion of SDF in outreach dental programs globally, especially for young children.